Uh, today we'll study uh, Mass Gospel chapter uh, 14, verse 27 through uh, uh, 72. Jesus prays at uh, Gethsemane. In the Bible, we can uh, see many prayers, many kinds of various prayers, but many uh, scholars said that this prayer is the uh, most prominent deepest prayer in among a lot of prayers yeah uh jesus prayed uh, honestly until he might uh, obey god's will he suffered a lot to accept god's will and obey uh, at first he uh, was overwhelmed with sorrow and anxieties uh, however, he prayed and he overcame all kind of darkness in his heart and he uh, became victorious and he was ready to be arrested willingly. So uh, this passage is very important for us to uh, learn uh, how to pray, how to pray, uh, to please God and to obey God, to uh, discern the will of God. Okay. Many things we can learn. Uh, okay. Uh, Dr. Hennibal, would you answer question number one? Sure. Uh, one, um, what prophecy did Jesus make about his disciples and himself? In verses 27 and 28, you will all fall away, Jesus told them, for it is written, I will strike the shepherd and the sheep will be scattered. But after I have risen, I will go ahead of you into Galilee. Yeah, so Jesus made a prediction about his disciples that they will all fall away. Hmm. And about himself, uh, he will be risen and go ahead of them hmm. into Galilee. Yeah. Yeah. So how firmly did the Peter vow not to abandon Jesus? So in 29, Peter declared, even if all fall away, I will not. Mm. And 31, Peter insisted emphatically, mm. even if I have to die with you, mm. I will never disown you. Mm. <laughs> and <the> all <laughs> others said the same thing. Yeah. Okay. So uh, yeah, there is a saying, Never say never, <laughs> because <laughs> you can you cannot keep the promise. Mm. Uh, but so why did Jesus sternly say that Peter would deny him three times in verse thirty? Truly, I tell you, Jesus answered, "Today, yes, tonight, mm. before the rooster crows twice, you yourself will disown me three times." Mm. So. Uh, Jesus understood uh, Peter uh, mm. more than Peter understood uh, mm. himself. <laughs> and uh, it sounds like uh, Jesus uh, told this to humiliate Peter, mm. you know, because, uh, no, no, you're not going to, um, you know, follow me, mm. uh, but uh, you will disown me, not just one time, three times. Mm. So three is uh, completely disown Jesus. Mm -hmm. uh, deny Jesus three times. Uh, so I think, uh, um, you know, Jesus wanted to help Peter to know mm -hmm. uh, his own weakness mm -hmm. and maybe uh, participate uh, in his, uh, Jesus' prayer in Gethsemane. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Jesus told uh, his disciples, you, all of you, uh, ran away, far away. Mm. Uh, I think that Jesus could be very frustrated. He devoted himself to raising disciples for three years fully, mm. but uh, it seemed uh, to be a failure in his disciple making. All of them will uh, fall away. Uh, mm. But Jesus mentioned uh, the scriptures, Echariah chapter uh 13 verse 7 uh i will strike the shepherd and the sheep will be scattered so mm -hmm. it is 
it will be fulfilled according to God's word. So mm -hmm. he was not frustrated and he accepted uh, all things as a God's will. And let's think about the attitude of a Peter. He was very confident mm -hmm. uh, not to fall away. Yeah. How, how, how do you think Peter was very uh, strong in response? Because uh, he uh, has um, the pride, pride of uh, mm. uh, chief disciples. Mm. Uh, he wanted to express mm. his uh, uh, courage mm. uh, um, because he, he should show mm. his uh, uh, excellent mm. uh, loyalty mm. Mm. So, so that he can be approved by Jesus. Mm. Uh, he believed that Jesus uh, will be a uh, king. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I, I think that he wanted to show up uh, as a top disciple. I'm different from other uh, disciples, <laughs> even though all of them ran away. Mm. I will be different. I will keep my mm. faith. He made a bow before Jesus. Yeah. I think that his bow uh, came from a true heart and not lie. It's a very mm. pure and yeah, he loved Jesus and he had been faithful uh, to his Lord Jesus Christ. But mm. he did not know how weak uh, he would be. Mm -hmm. and I think that he did not expect that uh, the tragedy that Jesus would be arrested uh, would not happen. Mm. So he could make a, a bow like this. Yeah. Mm. Should we say a uh, vow, not bow, but vow? But yeah. Vow. Uh, vow. <laughs> yeah. Vow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Please correct our pronunciation from time to time. <laughs> bow. Make a bow? Yeah, bow. Yeah. Yeah. Make a bow. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Yeah. And uh, what do you think about the other disciples' response? According to verse 31b says, uh, and all the others said the same. Hmm. First, Peter, what do you think about other disciples' uh, attitude and response about Jesus' prophecy? Uh, after, yeah, these, now it's uh, been three years since the disciples followed Jesus, and I think they all sacrificed uh, um, very much to follow Jesus during this time. And so they wanted to reveal each their commitment in, mm -hmm. in this way. I think the loyalty yeah, is a very mm -hmm. strong point. Mm -hmm. And I think behind there, yeah, the, um, there's the, the, the love that they have for Jesus. But I, it makes me think of, yeah, when Jesus reinstated Peter and asked him, do you love me? The kind of love that Mm. the disciples had uh, was it uh, like uh, every time was more like a, it wasn't an agape love but more like a filial love right or yeah well yeah i think it shows their kind of heart the kind of heart that they have uh, mm. uh how much are they ready to sacrifice i think an mm. agape love is really ready to sacrifice everything mm. yeah some uh many years ago i remember there's some Shepherds, they made a vow that even though uh, mm, Dr. Samuel Lee or Mudbury, uh 
uh, leave the UBF, I will not leave UBF. <laughs> <laughs> they made up. Wow. <laughs> but <laughs> nowadays we cannot see them. <laughs> when they confront the difficult times, they cannot keep their vow. It's a problem. In the present time, uh, yeah, I, 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 I will be martyred like Paul, like the disciples, but <laughs> in the difficult times, they deny and uh, yeah, they compromise. So, uh, we we should uh, acknowledge that how weak we are. Mm. Then we can pray, because uh, Peter was so strong and convic conviction, so he did not to pray. Oh, I can uh, die with the Jesus. So, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it is different. Because Jesus was sorrowful, exceedingly sorrowful, uh, so he prayed to Jesus, to the, to the Lord. Um, so the starting point of prayer is that, that uh, we should acknowledge how weak, how vulnerable we are uh, before persecution, suffering, and uh, threatening like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Question number two, Doctor jo Hosean, would you answer question number two? Yes. What was Jesus' mind as he took the three disciples to Gethsemane, thirty to thirty-four? They went to a place called Gethsemane, and Jesus said to his disciples, "Sit here while I pray." He took Peter, James, and John along with him, and he began to be deeply distressed and troubled. My soul is overwhelmed with the sorrow to the point of death, he said to them. Stay here and keep watch. So what was Jesus' mind as he took the three disciples to Gethsemane? Mm. Instead, is to share mm. his agony mm. that they may remember this historical event, mm. uh, Jesus' agony, to show it is not easy, even the Son of God, mm. to take up the cross. And he wanted to show that he had a sorrow, struggle to obey God and to the point of death. And also, so the disciples may remember uh, the, what was happening uh, one by one. Mm -hmm. And also, they may know the power of prayer mm -hmm. that how Jesus overcame such a difficult temptation and moment and how he was a different mm. before he prayed. He was a so sorrowful, full of agony. Mm. And after prayer, he said, let us go. Mm. So may, they may remember the power of prayer too. So what did Jesus pray for? 35, 36. Going a little farther, he fell to the ground and prayed that if possible, the hour might pass from him. Mm -hmm. Our Father, he said, everything is possible for you. Take this cup from me, yet not what I will, but what you will. Mm -hmm. uh, so, his prayer was uh, not ordinary. Mm. People think of prayer is to persuade God. Mm. <laughs> what I want, Lord, mm. until God listened to him. Mm. But Jesus' prayer was the opposite. Mm. 
uh, he was persuading him to obey God's will until he was persuaded by God's will. Mm -hmm. So this is a very uh, much that we I should learn prayer. Uh, and what can we learn from Jesus' prayer is uh, mm -hmm. uh, I found that it is uh, uh, we have a heart to pray to obey God mm -hmm. at the last moment when it becomes it is just so serious that that's me that I must be crucified. Mm -hmm. Then think of many things. Mm -hmm. he, uh, will there be someone else mm -hmm. than me? Or look around. How about him or how about her? <laughs> now, please, uh, please, Father, find but somebody else to die. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a lot of a lot of discussion and uh, protest and ask God, not me, please. Mm -hmm. I know it's good, but why? Why should I? At the last moment, we want to run away, mm. avoid. Uh, so I see this through this Jesus. To the last moment, mm. Jesus want, uh, want to obey mm. God. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Uh, according to verse uh, 34, Jesus uh, said, He was deeply distressed and troubled, and my soul is overwhelmed with sorrow to the point of death. Uh, is there any place uh, Jesus is agony like this? Jesus is the Son of God, but He's too weak and too uh yeah mm. in some aspect we can be disappointed jesus mentioned many times about this crucifixion to his disciples but in this time he himself was very uh sorrowful and distressed and troubled uh, what do you think? What do you think about this? Jesus is revealing obvious emotion. <laughs> yeah, several times in the gospel, mm. uh, Jesus revealed his uh, humanity. Mm. So in John chapter four, uh, he was thirsty. Mm. Yeah, it was noon at noon, and he was mm. thirsty mm. and tired, so he fell. Uh, he sat by the well. Mm. Yeah. yeah. And also, uh, we studied about fig tree mm. uh, because uh, he was hungry. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. he, he wanted to. He was looking for something to eat. Mm. And also, he was uh, sleepy. Oh. So remember, uh, before the storm, uh, mm. Jesus uh, fell asleep mm. uh, at the stern. Mm. So I think there are. At least three occasions, mm. uh, Jesus revealed his uh, humanity, mm. uh, you know, plainly. Mm. And here, actually, most, uh, most dramatically. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Good. Thank you. Yeah. Jesus is the Son of God, but He came to this world with His flesh, so uh, He feels all the. Uh, uh, Weakness and hunger and thirsty and sorrow. Uh, some people uh, does not reveal their uh, <laughs> uh, condition, even though uh, they have troubled. Uh, they pretend it's okay, no problem. <laughs> it's right. Yeah. What is our? What should we pray? Mm.
Our prayer should be, uh, I think, sincere uh, mm. from our heart, right? Uh, mm. Nothing. We have nothing to hide. I mean, God, we can't hide anything from God. So mm. <laughs> be free, free to yeah, express yeah. our burdens to God. I think mm. I even think about some people. Yeah, some people say, oh, you can even complain to God or cry. Mm. Uh, you get angry with God. But it's like you're, you're free to say anything to God, I think. Mm. Yeah, good. Um, it's necessary for us to reveal our heart honestly. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think as men also, we want to be, uh, we're proud or want to hide or just show that we are tough. <laughs> mm -hmm. We're all human, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Among ourselves, sometimes our co workers should. Uh, reveal our honest uh, heart and mind if we are painful and uh, distressed because of children's problem or uh, health and economic problem. Mm. It's necessary for us to share our honest mm. uh, yeah, difficulties. In the ESBC, uh, some of our student leaders were very moved that uh, senior shepherds uh, shared their honest testimonies with the tears, mm. so they were mm. so moved that they, mm. yeah, uh, they said, uh, it's necessary, it's necessary. Mm. Uh, yeah, because Jesus uh, distressed and troubled and his soul uh, was uh, sorrowful, he can participate in our sorrow and agony mm. and pain. Yeah. In King James, King James Version said, my soul is exceedingly sorrowful uh, even uh, to the death. Yeah, exceedingly sorrowful. Wow, so sorrowful. Yeah. Mm. And you know, uh, uh, crucifixion is very shameful and very painful. Yeah, un unbearable, uncomparable things. It's reality. It's reality. Yeah. So he revealed, and he, uh, he asked to the Lord at first, "Everything is possible uh, for you. Please take this cup from me." Mm. The cup of death is too painful to me. So if you can, please take this cup from me. Yeah. Mm. It's a very honest asking. Yeah. But he did not remain that prayer. Uh, he uh, prayed the Father, yet not uh, what I will, but what you will. Let's think about uh there are some steps of the process of Jesus' prayer. Shepherd Caleb, he's a servant of prayer, <laughs> expert, expert of prayer. So <laughs> would you share your prayer? Uh, I'm not a servant of prayer. <laughs> yeah, try to be a of prayer. Uh, normally, generally, people uh, think that uh, prayer is to accomplish their own will. Uh, mm -hmm. So for that uh, purpose, they pray and pray uh, honestly uh, mm -hmm. for accomplishing uh, their own will. Mm -hmm. I think that that is a prayer. That is mm -hmm. prayer. Mm -hmm. Uh, in this passage, uh, uh, Jesus uh, showed us uh, what the prayer is. Mm. Prayer is not uh, to accomplish their mm. own will, but mm. uh, God's will. God's mm. will. Mm. Uh, mm. And uh, eventually, God's will uh, is uh, best. Mm. Uh, last mm. uh, so we um, pray for 
surrendering, surrendering mm. yeah. uh, as we will. Mm. Good. Thank you. Uh, so, uh, God, uh, this is God, uh, keep on, uh, silence. Mm. Huh? Uh, so, mm. this is fair. Mm. Uh, be rejected. Mm. Prayer. Mm. Uh, we also we uh, found out two cases. Mm. Uh, Moses and the Paul. Mm. Uh, Moses want to enter the uh, Canaan. Mm. Uh, mm. uh, but uh, God uh, rejected. Mm. He did not permit them uh, to yeah. go to enter the uh, mm. Canaanite. Mm. Uh, Canaan, yeah. yeah. But uh, he, he uh, but uh, he received a God's will. Mm. Mm. And uh, he proclaimed the Deuteronomy mm -hmm. in front of uh, Israel people. Mm. Also, Paul uh, asked to God mm. uh, kill his disease, mm. but uh, God uh, rejected his prayer. Mm. Uh, but uh, God said, uh, it, "It is sufficient for you. My grace is sufficient. And, uh, yeah, you read, uh, my grace is sufficient. Mm. Mm. And uh, he." But uh, when he uh, was weak, uh, God's power mm. uh, works with him. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Good comment. So yeah. Mm. Sometimes uh, God uh, rejects our uh, prayer, mm. uh, but it, it is a good thing. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Thank you. Wow. Not what I will, but what you will. A great uh, obedience and self denial and a high dimensional decision. Jesus followed God's will. Yeah. And he prayed uh, three times. With the same prayer topic. Yeah. He prayed and again and again until he accepted uh, God's will. So it's not easy to accept at first. But when we pray, uh, when we continue to pray, gradually we can understand God's will and accept uh, finally. In the time of a critical moment, mm. uh, Jesus said this to, to, to God, Abba, Father. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. This is uh, in Korean version, it's Abba. Yeah, we think about, we can think about the relationship of the son and the father, mm. the God and Jesus. Mm. Even the Jesus knew the God's will. Why mm. do you give me so hard a so commission? Mm. But uh, even Jesus said here, Abba, Abba, mm. Father. <laughs> yeah, Jesus trusted it until mm. he did. Mm. The relationship with his God. Mm. Amen. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. This study is uh, very helpful for me. Mm. Because uh, uh, I try to restore my prayer mm. like Jesus Christ. Mm. When I was a uh, uh, step shepherd in Korea, Mm. Uh, 
I used to pray uh, deeply and uh, passionately mm. uh, with a heart for the ship. But uh, when I came a young missionary, <laughs> uh, my, my uh, prayer uh, so pulled down. So mm. then, so uh, when I, uh, so when I start this. Uh, uh, <clears throat> Jesus prayer. Mm. So I uh, try to mm. honestly mm. and passionately mm. uh, uh, to fulfill mm. as well. So mm. thank you. Mm. Amen. Yeah. Any other experience, uh, Pastor Phil, have you ever experienced that kind of a prayer in your uh, shepherd life? Uh, Self-denial and surrender to the will of God? I think, yeah, if I, I think of one prayer, well, when God put in my heart the calling to serve, mm -hmm. um, campus ministry mm. uh, in Montreal. Mm. Uh, yeah, it, for me, it happened through prayer. Mm. Um, it was, uh, I remember very clearly because, yeah, it's a New Year's Eve, uh, mm. year 2000, and mm. uh, I was by myself, and I said, oh, this is very sad, uh, celebrating mm. New Year by myself. <laughs> <laughs> mm. But I said, oh, I, I will pray. Mm. So I really just uh, simply pray to God honestly. And then uh, through that prayer, God planted in me a shepherd heart and calling to serve uh, mm. campus ministry in Montreal. So mm. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's not a really a pouring out of heart to God in my prayer, but I think honest prayer. And then mm. God blessed, uh, is pleased with that kind of prayer I found. Mm. Good. Yeah. Uh, Shepherd Abbott Gross, uh, he uh, delivered the message, uh, John's Gospel chapter 14 in this conference. So moving. And I heard about his decision uh, in Cologne. Uh, when uh, mm, Shepherd Bartonet uh, finished his term as a staff, uh, there was there should be the successor, huh? but but uh, Abbott Gross was not ready because he thought uh, he's not uh, mm, intellectual. Uh, he is the uh, is charge of a fitness club, so he can <laughs> play with the students, but to study the world and deliver Sunday message is too <laughs> difficult to him. And mm -hmm. he had the third, uh, the murmuring problem, speaking problem. So he was not fluent in speaking. So he hesitated, but uh, he uh, had the trouble in the Switzerland and he was so moved by the power of God's creation. So he surrendered and he, uh, uh, made the decision to give his life and he obeyed and God blessed him to uh, deliver message very uh, graciously and powerfully. Mm -hmm. uh, last year, e ESBC, his message was very good. John's Gospel chapter 1. This this year, uh, John's Gospel chapter 14, it is the way. Yeah, Jesus is the way. It's the main message uh, many uh, many participants were so moved by his message mm -hmm. because he was very humble and uh, he uh, tries to learn Jesus. Uh, God blessed him so much. Uh, so if we lay down our will and wow. obey God's will, uh, God is pleased with us and God blesses us so much, I think. Okay. Any other comments? Yes. Question number two about Jesus' okay. Gethsemane prayer. 
Uh, in my case, uh, mm. uh, it was different from Shepard Ebert Gross. Uh, mm. I wanted to be a, a step Shepard in Korea. Mm. <laughs> but uh, some, some, one day, Dr. Jan Jan called me to uh, give uh, one uh, direction mm. uh, to go uh, to Hawaii uh, as a <laughs> <laughs> driver, uh, missionary of a <laughs> Korean, Korean embassy. So, oh. At that time, I learned uh, Jesus' uh, prayer in Gethsemane. <laughs> so I, I prayed to deny myself and, mm. and uh, mm. I uh, uh, surrendered to God's uh, direction. So <laughs> I learned. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> we should lay down all kind of our plans, <laughs> step shepherds or missionaries and lay shepherds. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. A while, uh, two years, uh, I tried to. Uh, how such ministry restore mm. mm. uh, uh, but our uh, fellow leaders uh, do not want to open mm. their house mm. some shepherd uh, if, if I uh, try to this ministry mm. uh, uh, open our house mm. but they uh, get out mm. this is everything <laughs> <laughs> so, so I uh, give up my mm. plan mm. Uh, because uh, because uh, it, uh, I think that uh, they they are precious uh, mm. more than my mm. project. Mm. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So what is the result? So, <laughs> we, are, we, we are waiting, waiting. Waiting. And uh, preparing, uh, preparing. Uh, uh, slow and slow. Mm. One step and step. Mm. One step and one step. Uh, mm. yeah. But I will uh, study and continuously. Mm. I I try to restore mm. uh, house to ministry mm. in my our center. Mm. Yeah. Nowadays, many young people don't want to open their house because it's a uh, yeah uh pri privacy and so it's not easy when mm -hmm. missionaries come to uh korea our church in the past we welcome them and they uh slept mm -hmm. with the house but now it's all uncomfortable uncomfortable <laughs> but uh i visited europe in this year last last month and i stayed in cologne uh, some, yeah, missionary Jonathan Gang's house, and I uh, stayed uh, in uh, uh, missionary Isaac Choi's house in Moscow, and in London at Caleb Kuh's house. Yeah, Europe mm -hmm. uh, uh, missionaries uh, they accepted naturally, but mm -hmm. Korean people, Korean uh, shepherds. Uh, it's not easy nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they should stay in the mission house, mission house and guest house. <laughs> we will rather welcome our house <laughs> like that. <laughs> it's a great uh, change, change. Mm. <laughs> so I was very sick in Moscow and uh, missionary Isaac Choi uh gave their main room main bed to me <laughs> so i saw <so> moved <laughs> so moved <laughs> for 3 days i stayed there uh, yeah sacrifice to sacrifice is not easy uh, mm. but jesus uh showed a good example not my will but god's will yeah it's great uh yeah uh 
decision. Mm. Okay. Uh, question number three. Uh, Shifat Kaleb, would you uh, answer question number three? Yeah. Mm. Uh, why does Jesus tell his disciples to pray? Uh, mm, they should pray. Uh, uh, not to fall into temptation mm. um, because their body is weak, mm. even though their spirit is willing. Mm. Um, how was Jesus' attitude changed after praying three times? Mm. Uh, after Jesus prayed three times, uh, his attitude was changed. Uh, he was uh, deeply distressed and troubled mm. uh, even his soul was overwhelmed with sorrow mm. uh, to the point of this but uh, after his prayer uh, he was confident mm. and courageous mm. to coming uh, suffering and uh, even uh, he encouraged mm. his disciples to face the sufferings boldly mm. boldly how was jesus arrested and what happened to the disciples uh, mm, yeah, jesus um, was arrested after judas kissing kiss mm. uh, judas kiss uh, uh, Jesus um, and uh, one of the disciples, uh, maybe Peter, mm -hmm. uh, drew his uh, sword and struck the servant of a high priest mm -hmm. uh, and cutting off his uh, ear. Uh, but Jesus uh, uh, mentioned mm -hmm. uh, that the uh, old thing happened to him uh, to fulfill. The scriptures, mm. scripture. Mm. Uh, at that time, all uh, his disciples uh, deserted Jesus mm. and fled, fled. Mm. Mm. Um, all, all his disciples. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Any other comment? Question number three. Jesus, uh, uh, the human body like us, the mm. human way. Mm. He was 33 years old. And he, his struggle was so, so intense. Mm. As a young man, 30 years old, he saying he's the son of God and he must die on the cross. Even though it is God's will, can I change God's will? Oh. Is, is this true, truly God's will? Mm. If it is God's will, can I obey? Mm. There is many issues to overcome. Mm. But through prayer, mm. uh, he was a, uh, he was the same, but it seems he was a changed. Mm. That changed, but he he showed mm. out of prayer. Mm. Uh, I remember the Esther, if I perish, mm. I perish. Mm. As a queen, she didn't want to die, but uh, do okay. what Mordecai okay. was uh, encouraging him. She said, uh, give me three days prayer. Mm. Please pray for us. And after he pray, she prayed. Mm. If I perish, mm. I perish. So power of prayer make uh, a very courageous. Mm. And Daniel and his friend, mm. I understand. Mm. And uh, Pernis, uh Daniel prayed. And Pernis, 
no problem, lion's den, mm. he was a throw. Mm. So the prayer, a part of the prayer, make uh, three things I, I learned. The first one is to know God's will. Uh, is this God's will or not? Uh, through prayer uh, and through scripture, we know take up the cross is God's will. Mm -hmm. The second one is the uh, prayer gives us uh, to overcome, to obey uh, God's will. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, through prayer, uh, is a, our prayer is a, 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 to know God's will and to do mm. God's will mm. the, without uh, any uh, any more returning. Mm. So I also learned that these three things in the many, mm. many cases. Is this God's will? Mm. I didn't know. About through prayer, love, mm. and we, you should go by yourself. Mm. Is this God's will? Mm. I don't like. I don't think so. But, mm. you know, all these things, mm. each time, mm. and through prayer, I knew, mm. deny yourself and uh, Obey God is natural. Mm. But still, it is very difficult. Mm. One week of prayer, really, with a fasting, mm. God, God gave us strength mm. to go mm. to obey. Mm. And so I learned the prayer mm. is to know God's will, mm. to have a power to obey God's will. Uh, people, yes. Yes. Mm, yeah. Esther and Daniel's case is good example, I think. Yeah. And Abraham's case is similar, I think. Uh, Genesis chapter 22, uh, God told Abraham to uh, give his son as a burnt offering. It was so difficult. But I think he prayed uh, in order to understand God's will. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Finally, he accepted and obeyed. So God was so moved by him. Now I realize that you worship me. So uh, God made a vow that uh, from his descendants, there will be uh, Christ. Yeah. So... As uh, Dr. Osian said, uh, okay. when we pray, our spirit can be connected with God's spirit. So uh, we can understand the, the meaning of God's will and we can discern and uh, we can have a power to obey. Mm -hmm. Some people uh, don't want to pray. Because if they pray, they should obey. So they do not <laughs> pray. <laughs> they don't want to be disturbed by <laughs> God's will. <laughs> they worry about God's <laughs> uh, intervention in, uh, in their lives. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. They only, they had a had knowledge. They calculate and thinking, do not pray. <laughs> They do not bring their problem to the Lord or to their shepherds. They uh, think uh, by themselves. They think that is wise. But spiritually speaking, it's very foolish. Yeah. Uh, Hebrews chapter 5, verse uh, 7 and 8 says, During the days of Jesus' life on earth, he offered up prayers and petitions with Fervent cries and tears to the one who could save him from death. And he was heard because of his uh, reverent uh, submission. Son, uh, though he was, he learned obedience 
from what he suffered and once uh, made perfect. Even though Jesus is Son of God, he cried and prayed and he learned the obedience and uh, it made perfect. So I I learned that we, we should learn uh, through uh, crying and struggling of a prayer uh, like Jesus. It means that it's not natural to obey. It needs a struggle and crying and trouble. Uh, but when uh, through that uh, process and suffering, gradually we can learn, learn uh, the importance of obedience. You know, first, uh, man, Adam disobeyed God. So, uh, but Jesus' is the second uh, Adam, he uh, restored the relationship through obedience. Yeah, it's a great uh, decision to obey. Yeah. Mm. Jesus' uh, prayer, mm. uh, I also, I learned about Mm, the power of a prayer, mm. uh, prayer uh, gives us the power to do uh, mm. God's work mm. uh, properly, mm. and uh, uh, prayer changes mm. a person's heart, mm. heart from timid person mm. to a courageous uh, person. Uh, so we can do any uh, work of God uh, mm -hmm. if we uh, devote ourselves to prayer. Mm -hmm. Prayer. So important thing is uh, not um, not um, uh, who I am, mm -hmm. uh, but. Uh, uh, how uh, my prayer life is. Mm. Uh, mm. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Good. Good comment. Yeah. And according to verse 42, Jesus said, Rise, let us go. Here comes my betrayer. Uh, it is contrast uh, to verse 34. My soul is overwhelmed with the sorrow to the point of death. He was very weak, but after the prayer, he became very courageous and strong. He overcame all the fear and sorrow and ang uh, anxieties. So, rise, let us go. It means I will be arrested. I will follow. I will obey uh, to take the cup. So, uh, Jesus uh, became a Spiritual general to face all kind of things, uh, God's will. Yeah. After ESBC, mm. ESBC finished. Uh, all Latin coworkers praise God mm. because God blessed the ESBC so wonderfully. Mm. At the same time, they are very afraid. <laughs> 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 Because they have only eight months <laughs> from mm. now to next uh, April is only eight mm. months. Mm. Uh, eight months is 250 days. <laughs> Say only we have, how, how can you do like a European conference? Mm. No way, Jose. <laughs> so they, they want to learn from UPC. <laughs> how new generation preside or how music mm. and there are so many things to learn mm. uh, uh, with a small number of people mm. and they have a visa problem oh. they cannot go to mexico freely mm. mexico is like usa uh, mm. so now they apply visa mm. the El salvador mm. shepherds got visa I mean, mm. the Karana Shepherdess, she was denied. Mm. So, like this, Mexico mm. visa is so difficult. Mm. And the uh, flight fee is so expensive. Mm. 
Mm. From Brazil to Mexico is uh, from Chicago to Seoul, mm. 14 hours, something oh. very expensive. Mm. So it's a uh, uh, flight fee and visa problem. Mm. And uh, mm. they had uh, 620 years ago. Mm. The, they had uh, Europe 1100 mm. after. And so the Mexican and the Latin people are very much uh, pressed. Mm. How can you have a double number of 620 years ago? Mm. So much. So we found finally, let's pray. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, so it's a solution. Prayer, prayer is the solution. <laughs> <laughs> just eat. each person pray two times a day. Uh, yeah. 250 days, mm. each person can pray 500 times. Mm. Good. If you have a wife and husband, you can pray 1,000 times. Mm. Good. But American 100 missionary, if they pray two times a day, mm. You can pray 100,000 times. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. they want to know mm. the power of prayer. Amen. They still don't Amen. know how to do. Mm. Please pray. Mm. Amen. God will surely bless uh, Latin America <laughs> conference. Yeah, we will support the conference very diligently. And I am also afraid of uh Korea World Mission report to two years later. <laughs> 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 we, we had the uh uh discussion about the world mission report to two years later. Some shepherd insisted that let's have a Korea International Conference, Korea International Conference, uh mm -hmm. gathering all of the Korean uh chapter leaders and sheep and uh, invite uh, native leaders and uh, shepherds and missionaries. And then how many people? <laughs> Over mm -hmm. 5,000. But where and how uh, can we hold this? So I'm afraid. Oh, how can I? <laughs> uh, I'm overwhelmed uh, now. <laughs> I have to find out the place and the way. And there can be various diverse opinions. So I have a headache, headache. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we need a prayer, we need a prayer. Eh? What is best for God and what is necessary uh, for glory of God. Please pray for us <laughs> two years <laughs> later, what mission for them. <laughs> okay, uh, question number four. Uh, okay. Mm. Uh, Shepard Eliza Lee, would you answer question number four? Okay. Yeah. Uh, why did the uh, standard look for evidence to kill Jesus, but didn't get it? Um... <clears throat> they, uh, uh, <clears throat> uh, took Jesus to the uh, high priest and the, all the chief priests and the elders and the teachers of the law come together. Mm. Uh, they uh, try to uh, find the evidence mm. to kill Jesus, mm. but uh, there is no uh, evidence. Mm. Um, but uh, how was Jesus uh, condemned to death? Mm. Uh, high priest uh, asked to Jesus, uh, mm. are you the Messiah, the son mm. of the blessed one? Mm. Then Jesus said, I am. Mm. Uh, and you will see the son of man sitting at the right hand of the mighty one and mm. coming on the cloud of heaven. Mm. Oh, Jesus is uh, uh, proclaimed. Mm. Uh, clearly, uh, mm. he, is, he is son of God and mm -hmm. he is Messiah. Mm. He did not afraid of them. Mm. How did Peter deny Jesus three times 
and uh, what did he do? Uh, the, uh, but uh, uh, Peter uh, mm -hmm. denied Jesus mm -hmm. uh, as his uh, teacher and uh, Lord. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the seven girls of the mm -hmm. high priest mm -hmm. uh, I asked him, huh? mm. you also with him, huh? mm. but uh, he denied it. I don't know. Mm. Or understand what you are talking about. Uh, and uh, 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 he began to call down curses mm. and he swear to them, I don't know. Isn't mm. that? You are talking about. Mm -hmm. uh, immediately, immediately, the rooster uh, cloud, cloud, mm -hmm. cloud, cloud, the second time. Mm -hmm. Then Peter remembered the word that Jesus had spoke, spoke to him. Mm -hmm. Before the rooster cloud, twice you will disown me three times. And he broke down and went. Uh, he received the uh, Jesus word. Deeply, and uh, he realized that uh, Jesus know him very well, mm. more than him, eh? and uh, he repented, mm. repented uh, his uh, uh, weakness mm. and uh, uh, denied Jesus. Mm. Eh? Uh, okay. Yeah. Mm. Uh, okay. Rooster, rooster crows, crow, not crowd. Crow, but crow. Oh, crow. 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 Actually, uh, Peter said, "I am not." <laughs> mm. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, Peter uh, denied mm. Jesus three times. Three mm. times. Mm. Uh, three times means uh, uh, definitely. Mm. Uh, mm. Uh, so he showed his uh, weak weakness, weak mm. weakness. Mm. Uh, surely. Mm. Uh, so his uh, weakness um, um, was um, proven, proven mm. Uh, mm. surely. Mm. Uh, so uh, maybe after his uh, experience, um, uh, he admit mm. uh, his weakness and uh, uh, he become a, a servant of prayer. Mm. Uh, mm. You know, as as you know, uh, in act act, mm. uh, his uh, uh, prayer, mm. his prayer, uh, his uh, he was praying. He was mm. praying in many chapters. Mm. So <laughs> he experienced his weakness. Mm. Uh, definitely, mm. surely, uh, he mm. was changed. Mm. Mm. Yeah, good comment. He failed because he did not pray. So he broke down and wept bitterly. So he could not but uh, accept his prayer. Jesus warned him to pray, yeah? but he did not obey. He slept yeah? because he did not pray. So he was very uh, mm, uh, afraid and he denied Jesus. And he realized that oh, Jesus' warning was fulfilled. Mm -hmm. So later he, uh, I think that he might learn the importance of prayer. And as uh, Shepherd Caleb Kim said, he was changed into a servant of prayer. Mm. Yeah. And God blessed him to be courageous to uh, uh, be witness of gospel. Yeah. Uh, even though uh, the disciples were threatened not to speak the gospel anymore, but they said, 
we cannot but speak uh, mm. uh, about what we heard and saw. So uh, very courageous and strong. We all know <laughs> that uh, how when Paul was converted, mm. right? So mm. I think sometimes uh, I wondered when Peter was really converted. Mm. Uh, mm. I think uh, maybe after denying Jesus, at least we give uh, Peter some credit mm. uh, that uh, in verse 72, he remembered mm. uh, the word of mm. Jesus. Mm. And so he broke down and wept. Mm. I think uh, Peter was a very strong, you know, he had a full of confidence and uh, he was sure that he was the most loyal disciple mm. of Jesus, mm. but he broke down mm. and wept. So uh, I think he realized maybe, you know, in the past also Luke chapter 5, mm. you know, Peter said, I'm a sinful man. Mm. But I think here he really realized that he was mm. a really sinful man <laughs> mm. and uh, later came to know the grace of Jesus. Mm. I think uh, because of this experience, uh, he became very, very compassionate uh, shepherd mm. for uh, his fellow disciples and also God's blood. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, they said it is written, mm. he will all run away. Mm. Peter said that he will never run away. Oh. But Jesus but said, now, now Peter remember as a doctor. And he said that Peter remembered the word Jesus mm -hmm. spoken to him before the rooster cross twice, you will disown me three times. He listened, but he ignored that will never happen. I decided never I will die, but Jesus says, you will disown me three times. Your world will not work because I know who I am. I will uh, I will not deny Jesus. Mm. He broke down because the word of God came true. But Jesus had said it came true. And Jesus said, it is written, you will all run away. Mm. It happened. So uh, he learned the scripture must be fulfilled is, is true. So the scripture is two things. The Old Testament about Messiah will die. It, it is written and all in detail when Jesus died, it happened. Now, the second thing is that Jesus' world he said that he will come again. Or oh, it is written is uh, Jesus said the scripture must be fulfilled is before I come, the gospel must be preached to all nations. It will come true. So nowadays uh, uh, new generations, should we do world mission or should we go to to the end of the world or especially Latin people? They think, how, how come we go to Europe or teach the Bible? No. Should we go? And Jesus said, the scripture, the gospel must be preached to all nations. You Latin people too. You must go to the end of the earth before Jesus come. We should obey the world mission command. So next year we pray that Latin people listen to God's word. The scripture will be fulfilled that we should go. That the gospel should be preached. You Latin people to France, Portugal or Germany and the USA, you can go, you should go, because it is written. So with this, we want to plant the weak Latin people 
that it is time to go to preach the gospel to the ends of the earth before Jesus come, because it is written, Jesus said, yes. Also, uh, this part uh, uh, is very uh, shameful mm. uh, about G uh, Peter. Mm. Uh, but he uh, uh, confessed uh, this mm. denial three times mm. Mm. because of uh, uh, Jesus' love. Mm. Uh, more than his denial, mm. uh, uh, Jesus loved him uh, mm. more than his uh, his. Denial mm. and this uh, song. Right? Mm. Uh, Jesus said, I will go uh, after I have a vision, I will go ahead of you into Galilee. Mm. Mm. Uh, and he let uh, 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 him a uh, first mm. mm. And the uh, uh, Corinthians chapter 15, mm. uh, there are list, list uh, 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 that, that Jesus met the uh, uh, people. Huh? Mm. First is the Geba. Mm. Mm -hmm. Also, uh, Jesus uh, met him uh, mm. in the, into the into Galilee. Mm. He asked him, uh, uh, "Do you love me mm. more than this?" Three times. Mm. Mm. Uh, yeah. So he restored mm. uh, uh, his uh, position mm. and the uh, love relationship. Mm. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, this part uh, reveals mm. uh, Jesus' love mm. uh, more than his sin. Mm. Uh, yeah. yeah, okay, good so comment. Jesus. Yeah, even though G uh, Peter failed, oh, but yeah. Jesus does not fail. Jesus mm -hmm. uh, visited him again and restored, and he became a very powerful uh, yeah, preacher. Uh, after the ESBC, we visited Italy in Rome. I visited uh, Peter's Cathedral, so huge. Yeah, mm -hmm. so uh, he was hung on the cross reversely in order to learn Jesus' death. So, yeah, he, his life, uh, <laughs> final life was victorious. Yeah. He followed Jesus. He did not, he did not deny. Actually, he uh, followed and learned Jesus' life. Yeah. Okay. Uh, thank you. Uh, for, uh, Pastor Philip, any comment from today's passage? You must pray, I think. <laughs> must pray. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> okay, thank care of you. Uh, Dr. Hanniba, would you pray for us? Okay, sure. <laughs> Heavenly Father, thank you for... Uh, helping us to learn about Jesus uh, testimony prayer uh, our father uh, everything is possible uh, for you uh, please take take this cup from me but not as I will but as you will uh, father uh, thank you for Jesus uh, prayer of surrendering himself uh, to fulfill your will uh, father uh, we are as big as uh, Peter um, even though we, we want to think that we are uh, strong and um, uh, loyal to you, but often uh, we fail uh, in our uh, human weakness. Uh, so help us to uh, confess our weakness uh, very freely and uh, learn uh, to pray as Jesus prayed. Uh, Father, especially we uh, thank uh, thank you for blessing ESBC and Central Asia Conference. Mm. Uh, now our Latin America uh, co-workers are preparing for next year uh, Easter Conference mm. in April. 
Lord Father, please uh, help our precious co-workers to pray mm -hmm. and seek your wisdom mm -hmm. and seek your guidance and help mm -hmm. uh, that uh, you may uh, feel uh, all they need uh, more than uh, they ask for mm -hmm. and reveal uh, your glory. Mm -hmm. Also, Father, in 2026, also bless a uh, world mission report in Korea uh, to be abundantly blessed uh, when our precious uh, Korean uh, co-workers uh, humbly pray. And Father, uh, thank you for uh, giving us this uh, precious uh, Bible study together. I pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you, all of you. God bless you. Uh, see you next week. Bye. Yeah.